Hi everybody, it's Carol here with another project for you. Um, I'm joining a planning half day and I've been asked to do a tutorial. So if you've seen my video before on paper clips, that's one of them. And then I'm doing some bookmarks for the ladies. They can choose any two they want to do. So two of the book of the um, paper clips and two of these, whichever they fancy really. Um, they're all very different um, and all beautiful I think so let's get started I'll put these over here what I've used then is a very vanilla card cut at two inches by five and I've used our scallop tag punch um, I put it in and I always check because see it won't do it but sometimes it's off center depends if you've cut it exactly to two inches or not um, so I just like to check and these punches are so easy to check with just squish that and pull that back up put it back where it lives on my windowsill pull this rubbish away and then you've got three tags to play with so let's play with one of them first let's do the lady first because i really really like her she's in the beautiful you stamp set um it's 25 pounds you actually get two packets because there's so many there's 13 different stamps um and what i've chosen is this lady here so let's put her on a block and then the words i've chosen i love these live with passion, laugh out loud and love deeply. I've chosen that for all three um, mark, uh, bookmarks, I can't think. So I'm going to use some stays on ink um, and actually I'll do all three, let's do all three words. So the lady one, going to have down there the flowers I'm putting there and the beautiful flowers I'm putting down the bottom okay get rid of that for a minute so I don't need that again right why did I put that in with people oh, dear me tap it lady on there so you want her about there she is she's gorgeous and then what we need is I decided to use the stamp that's in the set if you look there's two and they go they you can use them to dress the ladies so I'm going to use this one um, it's the smaller one of the two. Um, take something. I'm busy doing a lot of projects today. And at some point, I am going to clean my blocks. So let's do a different colour, shall we? Um, I haven't thought about this. Let's do sweet sugar plum. So stamp that up ink it up actually is what I should be saying and then you want it about there okay so that's that one finished and you can colour her hat in if you want it's up to you but I quite like that so I might have to put a rhinestone on the eye but we'll see so the next one, let's do this one next. The next one is using Butterfly Basics. I love this stamp set. This is a gorgeous, gorgeous stamp set. And if you look at it, I have used it so much. It's in a right mess. Um, and this I've used, because I've used stays on on it, it's staining it. Um, and the reason I use stays on is because then I can colour it in. Um, it's waterproof and it won't run um, some of the other inks will run 
so you don't want that so and then what i'm doing is i'm trying to get the flower in and as much of the leaves as i can Oof. there you go okay that's that one now that, that actually looks really beautiful as it is um and i'm oh i might just leave it like that actually just to show them there's one colored in and there's one not yeah that's what i'm doing i love it actually that is beautiful i'm leaving that like that so do i color this one in for you right i will leave it like that for the guys but i will show you how to color this in because that's the one you saw again i've used the crayons i've actually bought two sets because i didn't like the thought of running out i've used orange because that's my favorite color in my last one um but for this one i'm just using a bright bright pink as you can see i'm not coloring perfectly i am being quite abstract i'm staying within the lines um but i am not being a good coloring person at all then get one of our blender pens make sure it's blank i'll show you what i mean by blank and pick up the crayon and look how you can just go and fill in all the little crevices that you've missed and then that will give it lighter and darker colors see you'll see it more on this big one absolutely gorgeous It does make me be quiet for a second. Only a second. Right, so you've done all the pink. Now, what's on your marker should be, there you go, some pink. Just wiggle it like this. There you go, it's running clear. So now you can do the green. You don't want to contaminate your green with the pink, do you? So that's how you use the markers. That's a top tip for you. Not that I've done that, of course. Right, let's do and the markers let you get more accurate. I actually used the um, the water brush on the last one I did. Um, so I'll show you how it's not as good, I don't think. But you'll see. There you go. And then you've got green left on here. You see, just make sure it's clean before you put it back in. So that's my watercolour. So if you see that one, it's not as still pretty, but so that's two of them done. Now the third one is the abstract and it's this stamp set which is actually free in celebration if you spend £45 in any of the catalogues you get you can choose from the little catalog and they've just added i think today some more they've added glitter card and medallion stamps and some more i'm not quite sure at the minute so i've used this and what i've used is this stamp the leaves and the little petals for the inside so that one that one and that one 
and then what I used was mint macaroon, sweet sugar plum and flirty flamingo. So the lightest one first is flirty flamingo. Okay, and just do some, I just did some random going up. Out of that. And then I bought in sweet sugar plum. And I did. Oh, see? Okay. One there. And then mint macaroon. I love this little. This stamp is so cute. And if you just, you don't have to do it from the edge, but it does look cool. So where else can I put one? Put one at the top. And I think that's, yeah, that'll do. All right, and then, there's my memento use that for the little black for inside I don't know why I think it's black but I do if you want to use a different color you can okay and then that one I'm just doing second stamping because it's near the words right so they are Let's get rid of that for a minute. Turn it over so I can use the other side. So they are my tags that I will be demonstrating and showing the ladies. Actually, on that lady there, I've got Glimmer, Winker Stella, um, the clear. And all I did was take it and just paint over her dress. Just see that. And you can just see it shimmer. I hope you can see that. Um, so there is all my bookmarks for the ladies to choose from. Um, I'm, and I'm hoping they'll love my projects. So I hope you love them too. Take care and I will see you next time.